All right. Thank you for staying with me, guys. Let's play some sealed. Good morning. Welcome back and nice to see you again. Yes. So we are playing against nature. Hmm. I guess this could be all right. Let's keep it pretty fast hand. My turn. Good luck. Wow, this looks like a construct nature deck, actually. But mugging is not a bad answer, I guess. Hmm. We could pip into the links, but I guess it's not worth it right now. We have no mana search, and it gives us two mana back with what we can only play the barrage. So I guess it's not worth it right now. Let's play the Shadow Paladin instead. Ah. Doesn't make more sense to play it now, I guess. Crayfish Afterlife. Unlock a mana lock until the end of your turn. Refresh one mana. Hmm, I guess now it makes sense to play the links. And let's play the other links too. to push him now. And if he plays now any big creature, we can use our removals. We have just to hope he cannot trade anything off. Ah, but he can. Damn it. And if he's, if the Batcher is attacking, luckily he can finish a second creature. That would be bad. Yeah, he's going to finish the second links too. Oh, he's even finishing her. Oh, damn it. My I wasn't expecting that. Let's get rid of this shot some. That was really I'm unexpected sorry. to you get rid of rest. all of those. Iron Tooth Goblin. Okay. So we can get control over the board. Double dealer, oh no. My choices defy me. Ah shit. Uh, 
That was bad. Mm. Now he's holding six cards and we have just one we cannot play yet. Uh. Low hanging fruit. good I guess that seal run might be over ah by the way our score is at the moment I totally forgot to adjust it it's at 3-2 at the moment the world. Animal bond. And Amazon construct. So let's play all of those. And I guess we're just going to hit the face. Led your sheep astray. Small creature creatures are all not worth his attention, I guess. So he is now unprotected. Ah, poison dart. Damn it. But he was bringing us a little back in the game for sure. Let's do some favorable trades. Maybe it would have been better actually to hit the face because his creatures are confused. He never knows how they attack anyway. Jawbone Scuttler. My choices define me. Ooh. Alexis Archon Swarm. But I don't want to play that prematurely. We're going to push for his life now, and when he's now struggling to trade everything off, he can still drop them. inside oh no oh no <laughs> insane come on we push him that is not possible no that was wrong ah crap I don't mind I was a little bit short with my mouse So I guess Orfeo is going to trade the Moonhound off. Betcha is probably probably going for one of those and the Rolling Watcher for her. So, but now they are all sleeping. Ah, 
And now we got Larseni. Larseni. Oh. AKA latency. Ah, but we can get rid of the Rolling Watcher. And come on, another Nikolite. So we definitely have enough potential for some lethal. Ah, Rapture Dance! Oh no! Damn, he's too lucky. It is time. Moon's mercy, I guess it's not worth it for those. I will not back down. Oh man. Oh man. I'm afraid it might be over. Now or oh, Alexis, Sword of the Archers. One, two, three. Nine, eleven. Well. Let's do it. The hunt. That was a great top deck here. But I uh, highly doubt that we can hit any damage in his face still. We got so many cards, so many options. Okay, let's send the Seraph back to his deck. We will that is see. Not possible. It's the circle of life. of superior but we can still hit the face or oh, if our other acolyte wasn't failing or if i wasn't failing playing that acolyte we would have just killed him right now now we have the hunt here again Why wasn't he hitting my face, huh? Duty calls. Shredder! Ooh! Alright! You promise peace, yet practice violence. Uh, 
I feel like it's so random who's going to win that round. It's just so random. So, it's getting some kind of light card again, huh? And his time is running up. Seasonal rebirth. GG. I didn't expect to win that game still. I really didn't. But I guess it's not really deserved. But yeah, let's play another one. One more and we are breaking even in that sealed run. One more win. That'll be great. That'll be great. Hmm. We're going to use our Acolyte again for sure. Let's shuffle Moon's Mercy in. Wow. This is a lot of mana refresh, actually, but I guess we need some... We need something for the first turn, too. If I may. Yeah. Exactly, I something like that I was doing. Hi. Three, three, four, refreshing mana guy is will be great on our second turn, I guess. Blade caster. Ah, oh, I don't like blade caster that much, especially when we have two, two lying around here. So next turn we are going to have three mana. When we play the links, we refresh two. And then when we attack with this guy, we refresh another one and we can also tap our god power. On the other hand, we could also play a dice. Let's take a look. First we play links. And then we see where he is going to hit. He's hitting her, that's alright. So I think we tap our god power here. Hmm. Keep that for later. Oh, he's playing already scale dance. That's nice. That means we are pushing him a lot. And he's not having another answer, I guess. Yep. Looks good. My choices defy me. Alright, great top deck, so we can keep up the tempo. Nice. I like it. Ah yeah, Ogre Archer is not bad. But I think it is time.
Death Mask. My turn. Fighting Fair. I think we just go for face and we transform. I think fair is now mana searched. So even if he plays an additional creature, we can probably finish it. Ah. We have to make sure now we're going to kill that. Battle Cleric and I think Fighting Fair is doing a great job. Collide, that guy up. I think that should be alright. He's not going to gain the board back again soon. And even a big removal won't help, I guess, because we have the Reflection Elementalists. My fate will protect me. If I may. All right, strong target for a lightning strike. A small victory. That was a pretty lucky round. He always had an answer to his place. Covering sigil. So that means he's not dead time. yet. He could have Apocalypse now, so I'm not filling the board more. That's just enough. Nethagram, okay. Interesting, but not enough. PG man, PG. So we reached our break even point. Yeah, we're getting the gods back from that run. Chaka. I like it. And I'm glad we can keep the deck a while longer. It's a pretty cool deck, I think. Hmm. War. Okay. War with death and deception. Hmm, I'm not sure. I guess we're getting rid of Lightning Strike. Maybe also the Crooked Quartermaster. Hmm. I'm not sure about it. Oh, let's keep that. This is a pretty fast hand. May we both see the dawn. Hmm. Okay. Let's start with the trail marker and the Leviathan Hunter. I guess if you don't want to lose against these Draconite shards, we have to be as fast as possible. Ooh. Switch to a list buffed. Interesting. Slivka, hello! Welcome back! Nice to see you! Let's keep the board clean. 
How are you doing, Slivka? Great. Uh -huh. And Draconite Shard. At work, doing some stuff. All right. I hope it's not too stressful at work for you. This looks really like a confused nature deck with the, all these confused wilds. Now we could need topic the gloam druid, huh? Gloam druid would be fantastic. And mercy. Shredder. Okay. First, we are summoning Acolyte. I have no clue how we should attack here. What? They are all going face like I told them? I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. Blonde Fang is strong mana searched. Oh, damn it. He turned the board completely upside down. We are going for Shredder. Stand your ground. Ah. If that isn't insane, I have no clue. Probably the biggest mana shard mage since long time. Agnarok. Interesting. Beauty calls. Sets, the light fades, day or night, war endures. It was definitely the right decision to go to shut up that turn. I was going to kill my small ones. Mm -hmm. I feel pretty safe now that he's down to two and we got a hidden two attack creature. But yeah, I could still heal or have some board wipe or something like that. We never know. He's playing death after all. A challenge. I accept. Not bad, but not enough. GG. Whoa, we are at six wins. One more, and we get a chance again for the coconut board.
All right, so let's use Acolyte again. I'm going to shuffle Griffith in, and the hunt is too big. Oh yeah, mana shard, mage, lightning strike, links. Seems the good. Light shine upon us both. Have faith and stay strong. Yeah, let's do seven wins. Let's do our best. Race him right in the beginning and off him. Let's start with the... Yeah, we will need your luck. You will need it. Jared Omero. Hey, welcome on board. Thank you so much for following. I really appreciate that. I hope you are going to enjoy the stream. How are you doing? Thank you so much for your support. My turn. So I guess could pip into the lynx and play the boar. If the boar hits the race imp or the rogue, I'll be happy. And the chance is not that low. So let's do it. Come on, not off here. Ah, damn it, it was off here. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> By the way, guys, um, don't forget to join our giveaway for the Shadow Starving Sabertooth. If you still need him, you can type hashtag giveaway in the chat. And as soon as we reach 880 followers, I'm going to give that Starving Sabertooth away. By the way, it was gifted to us by our dearest community member, Bad Chucky. Thank you for that again, Chucky. So, I guess we are going to summon an Acolyte. Going to play a Raptor Assassin and trade her off. Don't make me destroy you. I'm glad there's no Yukos in Eclipse anymore in the card pool. Otherwise, I would be pretty much worried about Trapdoor Assassin and Tetria. And I think there is not mm, more stuff that's the same thing at Death, Deception or Light in that card pool. Radiant Embalmer, what are you getting? Ray of Disintegration, not bad. The hunt? I guess we need the hunt probably for later. And I'm also not sure about lightning strike here. Hmm. I guess. We might just tap our god power and go for phase. He's probably trading off an acolyte and playing more creatures. What makes maybe the hunt worth? Oh, he's not playing a Dreaming Scepter. Hmm. The Blight Bomb. Ha, oh, I don't know. Strength don't know. and mercy. Ah, it feels bad to waste that much mana. That is not possible. I don't know. He's for sure taking now the board over. He's killing one with his scepter. Wrong path. Oh. Not bad. Not bad. Scepter is doing its job too. He's still got a ray of disintegration we have to keep in mind. So, same constellation like last turn. Oh, 
Copy the strength and health of a random creature in your void. Oh, I guess it was copying the rogue Skalka, huh? That was pretty unlucky, man. Let's stay mana efficient. In suspicious carry. So he is heavy. That is not possible. Not quite sure. Now let's play the hunt to take over the board. We are getting one bomb though, but we cannot change it right now. We have still some playable removals. We have still a pretty sticky guy. We can also tap our god power every turn. I think now it's more important to have control over the board. Having more parts though. It is time. Okay, lightning strike on the Tom Carver. Then the 2 1 is trading off the 2 2. Get it in the face and let's play the Beam Seraph. He's going to bait his Ray of Desintegration out, I guess. And he has just 2 mana left. Nothing to play any good creature right now. Not playing the ray. Mm -hmm. Ah, but a searchlight. Okay. That one's Anna searched, I guess. Huh? So, let's play the links. Hey, fearless. Welcome back. Let's fill the board with stuff. We are trading. We are hitting the face. Donating gods is going good today. We are playing the game we started two days ago. And so far, it's good, but yeah, that's, that was going to hurt. Oh crap. Demonic Skull. Shit. Let's send him to sleep. And he's still got a ray of disintegration, he's just going to... To disintegrate my mana shard fiend, I'm afraid. Oh, he has a hunting trap too. Oh, damn it. I thought we could tempo him down, but I wasn't thinking about a board wipe like end times. My turn. Or better, I was thinking about it, but I was, yeah. Just have no way anyway. I banish every blow makes us stronger. Yeah, I think so. We are going to hang on the six wins. <laughs> but at least we get our gods back and we have some free cards. My choices defy me. Donate me. <laughs> What kind of donation do you need, Chucky? My faith will protect me. Okay, it's game over. GG. Until he played the skull, I guess, it was um, pretty evenly matched. So, let's buy in again. GG for sure.
And then we are going to take a quick look into the packs we got. So, um, workshop opening pack. And like that. I guess Yeah, the rare packs here are not really interesting. Oh, Ballista though. Uh, epic in an in a rare pack, not too bad. Drider Sailweaver, two in one, and also an Assassin's Aim. Pretty good core cards, I guess. Pretty good core cards. Oni Spell Sword, yeah. So, the rare bounty pack. Let's see. Okay, Justin Shield. We have already a lot of those. And now the interesting part, the card packs. All right. Dark Dream Hex, Tartessian Improviser. Oh, Refractor Guardian in Shadow. Nice one. That was lucky, huh? Eragon. That we have also only once, I guess. Pretty nice. And Four Seed Tethys in Shadow. Holy fuck, what a pack! Holy shit, and I, the Foresight Thesis is one of the cards we are still missing from Magic. Wow. Should have either woke up an hour ago or slept a few more hours. Yeah, I guess I'm always in the team waking up earlier and doing stuff early. And not for sleeping longer. I guess Devouring Blade, Swap Basilisk, Shoreguard, yeah, Herald of Hydra, Future Industries. I'm very satisfied with the sealed rewards here. Very satisfied. Nice. So guys, let's reset our score and try again. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, we already see here a sick top end with Alexis. Lysander is also cool. And it seems like we have Glyn and War, and War means dragons. This could be a juicy one. Let's take a look by mana cost. So for sure we are going to play Scorch Blade and Claw and Fang. Oil Blood Outlaw 2 and Blight Bomb and Aging Veteran. We could also think about Pixies and Out of Its Misery, Smash Buckler. But I guess these are the one drops we really want to play. Hmm, Bad Luck is pretty strong. Tavern Brawler, Viking War Maiden. Omen Binder, Mana Search 6, Summon a Dragon from your Void. I like that. Double Scale Dance, yeah, we are going to play that. And I think we can also play the Omen Seed and the Lava Spitter. 2-3 is sticky. I guess Hollowing Light is good. Also, maybe Dread Pirate. And we are going to play the Blood Guard, the Blade of Sticks, Raid Reveller. Mm, the Seraph is pretty strong. Strong Path I like. Such an insane pool. Yeah, I have thought about that quite often. I have already thought sometimes, wow, what a great pool. And then I just lost three games in a row because my opponent was having the even more insane pool. But we will see, we will see.
Why, Avon? Thank you so much for the raid. Thank you. Guys, take a look at Why Avon's channel and maybe leave some nice comments and a follow. He will appreciate that for sure. And welcome, Raiders. Nice to see you. I hope you are going to enjoy the stream. We are just building up a new sealed deck. So... Inspired Simulacrum. I'm always thinking about playing that or playing it not. I'm always not quite sure. Hmm. And we have nearly no late game. Six, seven, and eight. One card. Hmm. Spiral Golem. It's not that awesome, I guess. Balance Eternals, I don't like. Alchemist is not good. The Nether Prince is strong, but the effect is not great. Yeah, yeah, it's going good, I guess. Thank you. And I, I think our pool is pretty good. Last sealed game was also nice. We got six wins and two losses. Hmm. I think Dawn of Invention is not strong, and Sealed especially. I'd go with one Simulacrum here. Yeah, probably. Probably you are right. Just if the game is going long that we have some... some big mana stuff. But the question is, what are we going to drop for that? Maybe a 5 mana card, because we have maybe too many of those. Maybe we are going to drop a um, Ray of Disintegration. Let's try it like this. It's nice removal plus board presence. Yeah, that's right, that's right. Oh fuck. Let's drop out of the queue again. Uh, we gotta change gods after all. We want to use our acolytes again. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for your for the reminder, fearless. Thank you. By the way, guys, don't forget to join the giveaway for Starving Sabertooth in Shadow. Soon as we are reaching 880 followers, we are giving the card away. You can join with just typing hashtag giveaway in the chat. The card was gifted to us by our community member, Bad Chucky. Thank you for that. And yeah, I think it's a pretty good nature card in some mid-range wild nature deck, probably. Alka Rider. Yeah, Acolytes are really strong. I guess it's one of the best god powers in Sealed. If not the best. Hmm, I like this hand actually. We can keep it. To the light. I'm just wondering. May the light guide your path. Yeah, we play Lava Spitter for the pip. And then play War Maiden and then Raid Revella. I'm just wondering, sometimes um, the Deception God power seems to be pretty good too. And I'm, yeah, why is he going with heal? That mm. is a little bit suspicious. Is he might playing something like Control Light or, ah, he's having Strength probably a lot of heal stuff. I don't want to waste my Claw and Fang yet. But otherwise we couldn't kill him and he's going to trade something off and going to heal him. Ah, it's also not, not fitting in our mana curve to play that now. Ah, ah it's such a pain. Ah, 
I hope it's all right like we did it. I hope it's all right. Fair. Eager Griffin. And we can still not finish both. I have doubts. Not bad, man. If I may. Not bad. Better clear his board. You think so? I'm not quite sure about it. I guess it's quite important that we have the claw and fang triggered. Yeah, we want to clear his bot, uh, possibly, but we also have to take a look that we use our mana efficiently and that we can retain some bot presence. Yeah, that was good. Ah, crap. Oh, man. I wish we had one more mana. I'm not sure. Now the time starts where retaliation can be really good. But I guess it's a little bit too expensive. Oh, no. The mana search is gone. Oh fuck, the card forgot it was mana searched when it's getting shuffled into the deck, I didn't know about that. But now we know it's... that's interesting. I really haven't thought about that. Damn. So guys, when you play mana search stuff... Keep it in mind, and when you play sealed, la bolle, bolle fuego is maybe not that bad even, because there is a lot of mana search in these sealed decks. So I guess let's just get rid of him. Use this time for reflection. Yeah. This might be a little bit too big for now, but it's not too long actually until until eight. And we have another eight mana card. So if he cannot kill Lysander right now, he did us probably a favor, huh? It is time. I'd have kept both, I guess. Yeah, I think it, it's both a reasonable decision. You have another rune of sight. Yeah, that's right. Let's dr try to draw some dragons. Ooh. Good. That is not possible. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
seven, eight. Ho 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 ho. Why not? We are having a lot of cards. We have another room. Ah, fighting fair, not bad. But we have way more, um, way more resources. Yeah, we keep them both. We must mount a counterattack. My faith will protect me. Rifford the Chosen. And the Deep Waterland. Yeah, I think that is a good target for wrong path. Mm, not yet. Since Griffith um, is going to set off four mana uh, for uh, attack guys down. Burspy, welcome back. No? Why not? Fearless. What? Tell me. What did I do wrong? No more Mark? We cannot play or do we don't want to play more Mark right now. So I guess the deck is good. Oh, T is empty again. Damn. Guy was rank eight with heal. Okay. Oh, it's is it the same guy again? I guess yes. Yeah, but I still think it's I know failure. a good deck. I will not fail again. It's not depending on our and enemy. Strong. Duty calls. Oh, yeah, I, get, I think it's the same, same guy. Creatures are both pretty fragile. Mm 
So I guess no need for bad luck yet. Mm -hmm. All right. Five mana. Radiant and ball mana. He's getting the back the omen seat. Uh, it feels a little bit bad, but maybe we should use bad luck and claw and fang. Sure. Protect our aging veteran that is growing. I have doubts. I'm a little bit afraid it took too much resources, actually. I think now we have to kill this guy too. But yeah, hmm. the aging veteran is growing. Can push some damage with the Blackfire Flatling. We need to. Duty calls. Got already and Our work is never done. But I guess we need to keep Kasha high now. Good trade. He's hitting the face. Ah, because he's burning all to ashes anyway. So board is wiped clean. Strength and mercy. Viking war maiden. Ah, Radiant Embalmer is tempting. I'm sorry, you earned your rest. But maybe she can equalize the moment. Yeah. Oh crap, that double dealer hurts. Oh god. We gotta kill him now fast. 6 damage, maybe 8 damage more to push. Would he trade that one off? Ah, it's still at it. Yeah, maybe. It is time. Maybe you are right. Oh, we are so lucky. That was so lucky. Wow. Francesca is already 93 bucks. Weird Talk. Weird Talk is the guy that kicked us out in in the last sealed run. Maybe this is sweet revenge. Maybe not. We will see. To the light. Yeah.
Mage really does run into Rage right Card for the first turn. Just bad that he got burned. Thank you. Thank you for the congrats. Thank you very much. Yes, the Atlantean deck seems to be the only real deck that works in the new set yet. You think so? Hmm, I'm not quite sure about it. I think probably... Um... Probably that... But Dragons is also pretty playable. Control War would like to have a word with you, yeah. Not only Control War, every war deck with some... Yeah, some... Stuff thrown in with Dragons. Oh damn it, I wasn't paying enough attention. I wanted to play the bad luck on that dude too, but we don't have enough mana. Ah, that was dumb. That's what you mean. You can kill opponents quickly. I hope so. Yeah, the death, death dragon deck I have not seen yet too. I guess it might be strong, but not too consistent. They always rely on so much graveyard stuff. I guess that is their weakness. That is not possible. It's new rock drakes. I guess the potential is there. There must just maybe a mastermind take a look at that. Rock drakes is definitely too complicated for me. And I think a, a viable dragon death deck will be even more complicated or maybe at least the same. Oh, I'm having another one of those. Man. If I may, you can discard the dragon and summon with the four mana spell. He just eat everything. Yeah, but you have to draw it before you play it. That's also a thing. Here in sealed, if you have some dragons, Glyn is really awesome. Oh, he's even putting him on the top of my deck so I can draw more dragons. 
but I'm not sure if we have more, I guess. We just have the Scorch Blade, Black Blackfire Flatling, and the sorry, Lava Spitter. So... Ah, <laughs> oh, we can draw the Lava Spitter, though. Omen Seed they have two, okay. Ah, and Omen Binder, okay, we have more dragons, I see. What next? Wow. Just go face and play flatling. Yeah, that would have been an option too. Yeah, that's right. But I wanted to do it cooler. Play the big seven mana dragon and then if he's not killed, we play the flatling and finish him with I mean, there should be a magic deck that uses new craftable legendary to just spell burst people down as well. Hmm, not a for counting the best deck. I don't know, that, that dragon is pretty expensive with 8 mana. But then, if Flatling isn't killed, which would be lethal, you play big dragon and trigger its afterlife. Yeah, okay, I understand as well. No. Why not? Yeah, yeah, there are these uh, magic decks with um, Avatar of Magic, I know, I know. That's right. So guys, I'm quickly going to get a new tea. Or am I going to get a coffee? Maybe one coffee more. We just had a tea. And then I'll be right back with some more sealed. I hope you stick with me. See you in a few minutes. I'll be right back.
All right, so here we go again with our sealed run. Oh, and I think the beginning is quite good, pretty promising. 3 0. I like it. Spectre! Ooh, long time not seen, I guess. He's playing magic. He's playing magic in sealed. With, while he got light too. Okay. I guess the omen seat might be not that great here in that matchup with the ping. Good luck. I hope to learn much from you. I. I need to grind back up to mythic. Oh, I hope you can do it. I hope you can do it. I keep my fingers crossed, man. But Cable looks like such juicy short is going to form. Can't play GU. What are you talking about? I have no clue. Table looks like Juicy Short is going to form. My hmm. choices define me. Ah, some some crypto stuff happening right now. You mean Forex. Ah, I see, okay. I have seen your future, you die. Hmm, he's doing good in keeping my board clean. Pretty good. Let's see what he's going to do to this board. Still have Claw and Fang mana searched. So he's going to shoot on one of my Vikings, I guess. Fair's fair. Oh, scale dance. With six mana we trigger it. Wow, oh, wow! Blödmann, thank you so much! Thank you for your subscription, I really appreciate that. Danke dir. Vielen Dank. Awesome. I'm a little bit afraid we cannot... ...mana search the scale dance right now. And we use claw and fang like that. But it's going to be all right. The light has left you. Blind. Thank you so much, Plutman. Thank you. It's very well appreciated. Oh. Endlich keine Werbung. Ah, das glaube ich, das ist ein großer Vorteil. So, dann schauen wir doch. Wir können can summon another Acolyte. And we can pip into Raid Reveller to trigger our two scale dances. So even if he's filling the board, we can probably deal with it. 
We can also summon our Echo Lights every turn. We have a wrong path if he got a really, really sticky, strong creature. Yeah, it's time for Scale Dance. Relatively evenly matched until we got our scale dances going. That was just taking the board from him completely away for two mana. This is true. This is true. Okay. Hmm. The acolyte should be alright. Not more to be here. Fused Strike. If he got another War Spell, this is pretty good. Ah, but it's not Mana Searched. Law and Order Inspector. Hmm, we could do 9 damage in his face. Yeah. And he's not going to find a way out when we place that guy on top of his deck. I guess it's GG. So, nice, pretty nice. Four wins already, so one more win and we uh, are breaking even, we get our gods back. And one more win should be possible at least, I guess. We got a pretty nice deck. And also we haven't lost any game yet in this run, so... It should be pretty likely that we can claim our gods back here. In that... In that run. So, Blade of Sticks and Lava Spitter I like in the beginning. Blight Bomb possibly too. Yeah, let's keep it. The light shine upon us both. I am your trial as you are mine. It is time. Mm hmm Well, I guess. Hmm. We have several options. I guess let's just play the Scorch Blade. He's not really worth the Blight Bomb. Ah, damn, that was good. My choices defy me. Let's go with the blades to tidy up a little. Hmm. Highborn Knight. God damn it. The purity this is strong. Of is found within all life. Let's go. It canonize. That is not possible. Beat the highborn knight up. Get up now, Lysander. Get up. Mm. 
so his armor is buffed. Hmm. Duty calls. We cannot play Lysanda yet. Play the Beam Seraph. Tap our God Plower and play the Lava Spitter. Guess let's take a look at our Draconite chart. Eric Hatchling, Light Eater Serpent, Void Jaw Dragon. Guess. Guess I'm not sure. Guess I go with this more sticky Light the Serpent. Let's trade that one off and play the Beam Seraph, I guess. Let's see if he can keep up with that. Hmm. Yeah, wrong path was good. Really good. Go with the Acolyte and the Lava Spitter just. he's not trading both of them off, he could make a good trade possibly with Hollowing Light. That depends a little. Hmm. Yeah, it depends how much he's going to. Ah, he's trading both off. Okay, I didn't expect that. Hmm. Yeah, I was more thinking about getting rid of her first and then maybe playing another dragon so the light bitter deals damage. He should have gone for face, you think so? I'm not quite sure about it. So if he cannot tickle out one more damage, cannot beat him. You're too low. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. I see that point, yeah, we are pretty low now already. I wasn't paying too much attention to my life points, but yeah, you are right. He should have raised at the moment, yeah. Yeah, I guess Strength that's and right. I hope that's not wasted. That not I'm afraid it is. But we can see. Every blow makes us stronger. Oh, I'm so glad he got Ward. Ah, he can kill him anyway. Damn. Hmm. No. Doesn't make any sense. I take no pleasure. Oh, 
I don't know, I don't know. But yeah, if he raced for the base, I guess we are already dead. Hmm. Holy crap, Rapture Dance. Oh no. My choices defy me. The blacksmith guy, he had that Hive's help. What is its name? I'm sorry. Prodigious Armorer. No problem. You're welcome. Hmm. What next? I'm not quite sure. He's skilled. I remember back in the day I used him to get I used to get him from Hollow a lot. I see. Are the Hollow is always giving you a random guild card, right? I see, I see. Oh the void drake is now strong in here. We need to get rid of the waxing the car, though. That is not possible. I failed once. Never again. End this now. Oh, was OP. Yeah, I guess. He was giving you a whole lot of value. Oh no, GG, man. That was that was awesome that game. Good morning, Kaspar Ten. Good morning. Ah, oh, so sad to die to a charm like that. Was just gonna say, look, looking for the comeback. <laughs> Actually, thought you will be able to turn this one around. Yeah, I thought so too. But the charm was just too strong on my void. Dra serpent or how he was called <laughs> and I was down too much I was also thinking thinking we, we win that Swally never punished <laughs> Swally will be a hard fight I guess And I like my hand. I like it pretty much. I'm not sure. Ah, uh, maybe I should have kept it just like that. I am your trial, as you are mine. Ah, okay. I know my own strength. My turn. Let's just start with the scorch. I think Dread Pirate is okay. Hmm. Ah, Maya Bloodworm. But we can take him down. This a nice canonize. Thing. 
That is not possible. Ah, penitence is strong though. My turn. But maybe not strong. Oh, bad luck. Bad luck is strong. Yeah! Our work is never done. Rebuild differently. Oh, I have blood burn. I see. Strength and mercy. Hmm. Cold fire. Hey, welcome back. It's going good, I guess. We have a great sealed run so far. Yeah, yeah, but we were we were lucky with that deck, I guess. Whoa, rotting dreadworm. Rotting dreadworm is insane, but a second lava spitter would also be interesting. Yeah, come on, we take the second lava spitter because we are crazy. Now we could spit a whole lot of lava now. But should we? Forgive. Come on. Yeah. Stay true. Oh, of the yeah, yeah. We were um, getting a pretty good deck for sealed in this run, so it's not easy, but we keep it up and we can do some great plays here. The score at the moment, you see it um, right be, uh, beside my starving Sabertooth. We have four wins and one loss so far. Yeah, I think so too. It's quite a nice score. So, Lava Spitter, do your spits? Yeah. Nice, I guess. And in the last sealed run, we were lucky too. We had we had uh, six wins and three losses in our last run, but My there were some some really bad runs before that. So we could do five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven damage in his face. That's not quite enough. But I think we try to erase him down anyway. But I think we are keeping that stuff just in case he's having a board wipe. Okay, looks like GG. Yeah? Maybe. GG. But yeah, this deck we have here is really crazy strong. We have so many dragons and Glyn that is drawing us the dragons. Oh, it looks like our client here is broken again. The news section. What? Maybe I'm going to restart that. Be more safe. I don't want to lose any games. 
What did they update? I had an update an hour ago. Yeah, I had um, updates too, but I don't know what they have updated. I'd be more surprised if it wasn't broken. Giant is so buggy lately. Oh, yeah. Comet, welcome back. Serze, welcome back to you too. Nice to see you guys. Cheers. But yeah. It is pretty buggy lately, that's right. Yeah, yeah, it's, it was definitely good that they um, removed that private key stuff. I think so too. I'm not sure about Claw and Fang right in the beginning, but I guess I keep it. Best of luck. Let us be true to each other for a change. My turn. So, aging veteran, here we go. War and light sealed runs are illegal. Yeah, yeah, they are. And I guess it is maybe. It's not the first time that we do that, but it's very rare. If I may. Hmm. I love the blood guard in sealed. So much value in one card. In the beginning for just three mana. Just summon Echolite to trade that guy off. But yeah, I think Thievery is also a good god power. That uh, depends more on the matchup. Summoning in 2 2 Echolite is in every matchup a good deal. You don't like Thievery? Um. I was thinking about that too, yeah. But in late game you don't care ma as much as about mana. In the beginning to play it it's really not good. You're losing too much tempo. But in the late game it can give you so much value. But yeah, sometimes you get useless stuff it's like time. sit down. That doesn't do that much. At least for, for a while. Rapture Dance incoming now. My opponent always have their right spells when he plays thievery. Hmm. I know that feeling. Ah, he's having an auric mage, okay. If you play against deception, game can take for hours like no ending, yeah. I guess that's quite possible. Their plan can't be that obvious. It's not always like that, but it is definitely something that yeah, might happen with control deception. Good morning, Psycho! Welcome back. Welcome back. Nice to see you as always. Ooh, that one is sweet. But I guess we want to trigger a scale dance right now. Oh, I'm doing great. I had a great rest last night and today I'm ready to smash it again. And so far we are doing pretty good in sealed today. 
I'm quite satisfied. We had a six win run in the beginning. And now yeah, we are standing 5-1. And how are you doing, Psycho? So, um, why did he attack him? Yeah, agro playing agro is a huge help. I guess when you don't want to spend hours at playing. Let's go get him. Being ready right to smash it today scares me. Considered your job. Yeah, that's why I'm smashing cards on the table. So I, I there's no need to to smash anything else. Ah, nice. Good to hear that, Psycho. Good to hear that. So, that guy is still hidden. Could try to get him with Lava Spitter, actually. But I'm not sure if it's worth it. Our work is never done. Mm, I guess not. Hey, Ragnar! Welcome back! Nice to see you again. Who did you pay to have such a good sealed runs? Um, actually, I don't know. Heat heal. Um, yeah, I'm afraid with Lysander. When I killed her with Lysander, that he's going to kill Lysander, you know. He would already down to 4-4 four, four without the Ogre Archer. But he heals at the end of... No, no, he heals at the beginning of your turn, not at the end. At the start of your turn, completely heal this creature. My latest sealed runs are so tilting. Oh, I know that. I know that. I know that feeling. He definitely sacrifices something for the gods. Hmm. Maybe it's just I pay uh, I play so much um sealed that maybe the bad runs are not that that often seen. Hmm. I don't know. That is not possible. When you take a look at YouTube at my archive, I have also a lot of bad sealed runs. Don't worry. I'm not quite sure. Take a look if he can spit some lava on that guy. Yeah. To Satan. Just listen to the songs. Oh yeah. But don't confuse him with Santa. Satan and Santa is pretty close. And they are both wearing red. The bigger they are, the more they suffer. This is insane.
Yeah, there's even Grendel no help, huh? So, this looks like we could, we could maybe make a seven win run. He was really trying hard now to prevent this damage. All right. Let's try again. What is our next opponent going to play? Merciless, light against light. Hmm. Yeah, let's use the Acolyte like usual. I guess Retaliation got to go. Omen Seed is interesting, especially with Omen Binder. But maybe they are both too early in the game. Ah, but Halloween Light I don't like in the beginning. Scale Dance I don't like too. Maybe he should have just kept the Omen Seed, I don't know. Hmm. Feels bad to play that one right now. But not to play anything feels bad to. Ah, uh, I don't know. Come on. My cable short is going perfectly. I'm of half mind to just take the profit and go grind to Mythic. Hmm. Why not? So he wasn't doing anything on his first two turns. But he got nice card backs. Oh, no, sleeves. I mean, sleeves. Must be sleeves. So this guy, Afterlife Summon, a 3-2 experimental outcome. Strength and mercy. Let's get rid of it. Let's play the blood. You only make my light burn brighter. Oh, I could be sad if I don't. Hmm. Because I could be sad in a few hours if I close positions now. Yeah, man. Fearless, I have no clue, actually. I have no clue. I'm not a financial acquisition guy. Strength and mercy. Did you quit the other crypto games? Not really, but I don't have much time to play anything else. When I'm playing so much um, GU like now. Hmm. So I have to always to think about what am I doing and yeah. My time is limited and at the moment I'm having so much fun with GU that there's not much time for other stuff to play right now. Yeah, yeah, exactly, especially with sealed. I hope we are just getting more players uh, with the mobile version. <laughs> yeah, Comet, I know what you mean.
My choices define me. Yeah, I think it's not as bad as in the beginning. They already worked on it. I think in, right in the beginning with Tides of Fate, Sealed was worse than it is now. They already adjusted the cards a little. But I still think the Mortal Judgment sealed pool was uh, more fun. More grindy. I don't know. Less faced on the huge top end cards, I guess. And with less bombs. Yeah, most crypto games I have seen so far are not that great. What I still like is uh, Warsaken. I'm still curious there about the full game. I think the, the Blitz mode is getting old very quickly, but full game could be interesting. And Parallel is also interesting, but I don't like the theme, uh, the parallel theme and the Warsaken theme so much. I'm more a fantasy and middle ages guy than sci-fi and war. So we have you some damage to push me. here, so that could be our nice 7 wins run, huh? I failed once, never again. Wow, what a creature. GG, man. My turn. So let's take a look at our packs and maybe even at our new coconut board. Let's go. Going to buy in again for sure. So, uh, I guess I gotta There are three bots now. Gold, gold, gold. So I guess next one gets pulled in a week. It's time a gold or shadow. We will see. Will be four now when he opens one. Let's take a look. Okay, that rare pack is a little bit underwhelming, I guess, but the others might show up right away. Mm -hmm. All right, epic bounty pack. Here we go. What the hell is that? Radiant light cards back. Ah, we have that already. So, hmm, they said that someday it will be um, a part of crafting to use your your um, yeah cosmetics. So I'm thinking about selling double cosmetics, but I'm not sure if I should. Because if they are part of, of you know, crafting, I might rather keep them. The Prayfish is good. I don't have him yet, but the rest of the cards I sadly have already. But the Prayfish we don't, and I'd like to experiment with him when we have a playset. Oh, 
Deuteria, Raving Necromancer. Yeah, Refractor Guardian, nice. We need that guy for crafting still. Another Preyfish, great. Now we have that as a playset too. Okay, I guess from the last run, the packs were better with the six wins, but I don't complain. Imagine if it was a board with bugged pack opening. Oh yeah, that would be epic. A typical GU thing, huh? So guys, let's take a look at the deck. You need a meteorite one, right? Yeah, I guess so. You cannot use your shadows or golds for crafting. So, let's build this deck up and then I'm going to end the stream and play with that tomorrow. Because I don't have enough time left. You can't? Yeah, you can't. What? Can't use shinies to, to craft shinies? Yeah, I guess you could, maybe. I don't know. If you can use 10 shadow cards. I don't know. Veersby, I'm sorry, I need to go to work. I'd like to stay, but sadly I can't. Yes, shadow will craft shadow. Okay, okay. But I think it's not realistic for me personally to have... 10 shadows to craft a shadow? Nah, I cannot do that. I am I will be happy when I have 10 meteorites to craft a meteorite. But yeah, I'd, I'd rather like to use a shadow as 5 meteorites and use it together, the shadow with 5 meteorites to get a um, meteorite. You know? <laughs> But not backwards compatible, as far as I know. <laughs> yeah, sad, though. But we can't change it, I guess. As they said, there are four recipes for every card, okay. I guess we have here quite a decent pool, huh? The, the three mana cards are pretty awesome. Mm, but I guess we probably get rid of the one mana dragon whelp. I would love to decraft cards. Yeah, that would be cool if we could. Buy a sheep shadow legendary, decraft, sell four meteorites and roll in money. Yeah, I guess it would... It would be a lot of arbitrage there. And you gotta be fast. And uh, that would definitely uh, iron out the price differences between... Um, yeah. Between the cards. Hmm. Oh, we got a Pius Giant. Nice. And the uh, other big cards, except se Seasonal Rebirth, are crap. I would mean Shadow cards increase the price to 5 Meteorite. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Hmm, I'm not quite sure about this deck. Hmm. I guess we need to take a closer look at that tomorrow. We might play it like this, or maybe with a small adjustment, but yeah. I'm sorry that I got to leave, guys, but I'm going to see you tomorrow again. I hope you're going to have a nice day, and good luck for your games. Thank you for watching, it was a nice stream, as always. 
Yeah, take care, everyone. So, and let's find someone for a raid. Let's take a look online. War or yeah. Optonius Rex. Ray. Oh. I have never heard of War or Coop. Tia Kupipa, oh, what a name! And he got zero followers. I'm just the first follower that follows that guy. So let's rate him. I guess it's probably his first stream. So let's uh, le have him a uh, nice experience, guys. Let's rate War o Kupipa. War o Kupipa. Let's go. And guys, leave him some nice comments. Leave him some follows. He's going to be happy for sure. Here we go. Have a great day. Bye bye. Let's rate.